Good morning everybody. So it is Sunday today and we have decided to go to the beach. Um, we don't normally go to the beach on a Sunday. We normally leave this for a holiday activity. But we've decided to go today. We're going to take Daddy to Canvey Island. He's never been to Canvey Island before. Apart from the miniature railway. Apart from the miniature railway. Um, I've I've been with Ted and I think I've done a vlog on that. If I can find it, I'll link it in the description box below. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, we thought we'd go to Canvey Island today, have our lunch, have a little play on the beach, perhaps have an ice cream from the cafe. And then we're going to come home and I'm not sure what we're going to do this afternoon. Massage but Daddy. Massage Daddy, my husband just said. Yes, <laughs> that's probably what we'll be doing this afternoon. So yeah, anyway, we thought we'd take you with us. And we will see you later. Bye! Say bye, Ted. Daddy! <laughs> Yeah, it's very slow. Oh, I'll tell you, I wonder if that one in front is actually sort of guiding him down the boat, down the river, because he has to go right in the middle. Oh, maybe. It's, it's shallow. It's shallow either yeah. side.
so we are back from the beach as you can probably tell um, Howard is currently in the back room watching the telly Ted is uh, going to play on the switch in a minute he's got the tablet going and he's going to play on his switch for about three quarters of an hour that's how much we allow him in the afternoon um, yeah we've been back for about an hour uh, and I've got on with a few jobs. I did mean to take you with me, but I completely forgot. As per normal, it's always the way with me. Um, so I have made some biscotti that I'm going to put in the oven soon. Um, and I've tidied up the bags from the beach. Um, I forgot to get the salmon and the prawns out for dinner. So we are having salmon and prawns, spicy salmon and prawn burgers for dinner. And I forgot to get the salmon out earlier. So I'm hoping it defrosts. But I just have to say that, um, what was I going to say? Oh yeah, I do have to put it in the food processor to make the burgers. So I'm hoping that when I put it in the food processor, it kind of defrosts a bit more. So yes, fingers crossed. Um, I've got about an hour until I've got to make that and that's been out for an hour already. It's quite warm today, so I'm hoping that it will defrost in this weather. Um, and yeah it was quite nice at the beach it was really lovely um it was really nice just to sit and and chill out for a while i've been a bit busy this week i've been trying to make a lot of videos before ted goes on summer holidays so i get to spend a bit more time with ted instead of always making videos and stuff while he's here so i've made a load of videos um that have been scheduled to go up over the summer holidays so yeah i've been quite busy so it was just nice to sit down um, and chill out for a while and just watch the sea we had a little paddle as you will have seen on this video so that was lovely as well um so yeah uh that's about it so i'm gonna go and sit down again for a little while and chill out my mum gave me a book recently um it's the not the big book of herbs the ultimate guide to herbs um, and I want to have a look through at the foot spas I'm thinking of making a video on one of their foot spas in there because it looks really interesting so I'm gonna go and have a look at that in a little while um, and then I'll make dinner and then I think Howard and Ted tonight are going to be watching the final Star Trek movie so Howard bought a Star Trek tr like um, box set of all the movies um, and Howard and Ted have been watching those over the past, I don't know, five or six weekends. Um, and Ted wants to watch the last one tonight, so we've agreed to let him. It's Howard's turn to put him to bed tonight. So we've agreed to let him watch that. So they're going to watch that. And I um, have one more video to do for the six week summer holidays. And the week I did it, I forgot to film the actual meal so I like to put um, a clip of the meal in at the beginning and in at the end and I forgot to do those two clips and I also forgot to take photographs of it as well so I've got to do that later so I'm just trying to remind myself of what I've got to do later once I've cooked the dinner so yeah I've got to film that and then um, uh, take some photographs and then I think I'm going to upload that video later so yes, that's about it so far. So I will try to take you with me as much as I can. I did mention the Ultimate Book of Herbs in my favourites video right at the end last week, but I will go upstairs and get it and show you it in a minute because it is such a good book. I can't, I can't put it down. It's one of those books that's just really interesting um, and I'm learning quite a lot from it as well. So it's got, in the Ultimate Book of Herbs, it's got... Um, all of the herbs that you probably ever need to know about um, and then it's got ideas of how to use them so you can use them in the home you can use them as uh, oh, potpourri so like smelly stuff um, you can put them in candles oh it's really interesting so yeah I'll go upstairs and get it and show you it in a minute so I just thought I'd show you the ultimate book of herbs this is by Reader's Digest I don't know who it's written by but it's from the Reader's Digest, I looked it up online. Mum gave me this book, but it was about £44 on Amazon, so it wasn't cheap. Um, but yeah, it's just a really interesting book. Um, and it's got lots of uh, ideas on how to grow herbs, 
on what to do with them, how to cook them, how to use them in your home. So I'm finding it fascinating. Oh, it's also got beauty in here as well. So if you're interested in beauty and herbs, then this is in here as well. So it's an absolutely fascinating book. Um, I've just put the biscotti in the oven. So I think I'm going to sit up here because it's a bit quieter than downstairs and read this book for a little while. And then I've got some, the washing to put away. I think the dishwasher's got to go on. So it's back to normal mundane tasks now that we are home. Um, it's so lovely to go out and not have to think about the housework. Hands up who loves going out and not thinking about the housework. I have to say I do. So yes, I'm just going to sit here and read this book for a while and then I think I'm going to go downstairs and do all my little tasks. I just thought I'd share with you that this is part one of the biscotti so I've just got to slice this up and in this recipe I used eggs but I think I used too many eggs. I used two eggs and I think I should have probably only used one um, but it does smell really nice so that's a chocolate biscotti and I've also managed to make my fish burgers as well so I'll show you that now so yes there's the fish burger mix um, I managed to get the skin off the salmon and I put the prawns and the skinless salmon into this food processor and just blended them together and they seem to it seems to have worked um, I normally fry these off so I'm hoping these cook okay I'm gonna form these into burgers now and I'm gonna put them in the fridge for a little while I normally make these in the morning and then fry them off in the evening but I forgot I completely forgot today oh well best laid plans of mice and men hey but I'm gonna do it now we have this with chips and I'm having salad I can't wait it I love these burgers they're so yummy it's very noisy inside at the moment so I thought I'd come outside it's a lovely evening it's still quite warm as well so it's really nice to sit in the garden and get a bit of fresh air um, I have been quite busy since the last time we spoke um, I finished cooking dinner it was delicious and I will insert a clip of what we had here so it's like a sa spicy salmon and prawn burger um, and it was so yummy and I've done a video on it but I'm not too sure when it's going up I think it might be about three weeks from now um, I've done as I said I've done enough videos to cover me for the summer holidays I'm also gonna have a week off in August as well I haven't ever done that before but we're going on holiday and I just want to break for a little while so I'm gonna have a little week off in August I think um, and just not feel well I'll film the holiday but I won't put any videos or any blog posts up that week I don't think so yes I have done all my jobs finally so I can sit down for the evening um, I'm probably still get on with a bit of work I do have this shopping list to do as well um, Tad and Ted's film has nearly finished so I will ask Ted if he wants to do the outro if not it will be me again but I'm sure he will but I think I'm gonna end the vlog here now um, we've had a lovely day as always it was really nice to go to the beach it was just really nice to get out of the house and just to sit still and watch the sea come in that's what we did I think we just sat on the beach and watched the sea come in and it was lovely it was really peaceful and really lovely so yes I, we've had a lovely Sunday so I think I'm gonna go and if Ted wants to I will hand over to him 
Now, as you can probably tell, Ted didn't want to do the outro. Sorry, everybody. Um, he said he was a bit too tired, so I'm going to do it now. So thank you so much for watching. Please feel free to give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And please feel free to leave any comments below. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you all soon. Bye.